In today's video, I want to talk to you about how to beat the meta run defenses in Madden NFL 21 in just a very, in a very, very simple way, honestly. So uh, if you're interested, guys, I post four videos a day here on YouTube that give you tips like this, tips that are intended to help you become a better Madden player. And again, I'm not the best Madden player in the world. I don't claim to be that. I have a long way to go to get there. But what I am very keenly aware of is as I get better, I can help other people get better. And so that's really the goal of my channel. I try to learn as much as I can about the game so that I can inform you as much as I can about the game. That's really all I'm trying to do. And so in today's video, I want to do that. I want to give you a quick tip. Um, but if you're interested in being part of the channel, I just want to encourage you to go ahead and click that subscribe button. The play we're talking about today comes from the West Coast Playbook, but it can also be found in other playbooks. And that is the iForm slot. Now, I want to talk to you about two specific plays from iform slot and then i want to talk to you about the meta run defense most people if they know what they're doing as far as run defense goes they're either running big nickel over g or nickel 335 wide and most of them are using man-to-man -man coverage they're either using the cover two man or the cover one to stop the run because running or um man-to-man -man coverage does a lot better job well, what we're going to do is we're going to talk to you about the dive alert bubble and the stretch alert bubble both are very similar in how we're going to deliver this tip to you so we're going to focus first on the stretch now, what most people are going to do is they're going to man align and they're going to press and they are going to shade coverage outside and shade coverage over top. What you'll see is against man to man coverage, when, when somebody runs man to man coverage on you, you can throw these bubble screens with a high, high, high success rate. I've done multiple videos on bubble screens this year. I think bubble screens are very, very important to have at your offensive disposal in some way, shape, or form. And as you'll see, uh, for whatever reason, Kevin King is like super shedding Devontae Adams right now. So what I'm going to do is just bring him across to the right. Uh, but what you'll see is this bubble screen will beat man-to-man -man coverage very, very easily. See how he just kind of stands there? And look, I'm able to beat it for a solid game. It's very, very hard to stop. Uh, most people aren't going to, most people are going to man align. Uh, most people are going to man align to try to stop it. What's ironic about bubble screens is when the bubble screen is left so low, when the bubble screen is left completely alone, like it is going to be right here, it's actually going to work better um, because the, literally a defender is going to stand there and allow himself to get burned by the bubble screen, as you can see right there. So motion over bubble screens is really the tip. I mean, and that's what makes this run so good. Um, you really can't run man against it. You have to go to zone coverage. There's no way to run man against it and still have good gap integrity because what's going to happen, what people are going to do is they're going to, they're going to have to drop hard flats like this right here. They're going to have to drop something like this to be able to stop this run um, or to stop this bubble screen from happening. As you can see here, the hard flat's going to come down and ideally is going to stop this play from happening. But the issue where the defense is vulnerable is um, what happens is when they drop the hard flat over there, they're going to leave themselves vulnerable to the run because they now have one less person in run support. They have one more person that's counting for the bubble screen, but you're going to see I'm able to get four to five yards every single time just by running the ball, whether it be the stretch or whether it be the dive. And so if I see somebody trying to drop their safety on the left side and curl flat coverage just like this right here, what you're going to see me do is I'm just going to go to the dive and I'm going to literally run for four to five to six yards every single time. What they're going to have to do is they're going to have to go to zone coverage. The problem with zone coverage um, is it's not as good. The defenders don't react as well uh, to the run, and so it's going to open up the run even more uh, for you. So it really puts your defense um, or really puts your um, defenders in a pickle because there's just not a whole lot that they can do to be able to stop this. Now, if you guys have not already, I do want to encourage you to join our texting membership. Our texting membership is very, very simple in how it works. Literally, it's 100% free, and yes, it's 100% my personal information. So just kind of take that into, co into consideration. You are talking to me personally when you sign up for this. But my number is 812-216-3644. It's also in the description. All you have to do to receive those tips, those exclusive texting tips that I send out once every week is just send me a text message you can also feel free to send me a text message with any Madden question that you have so as you have Madden questions as you have things come up I would highly encourage you to take advantage of that opportunity because what I'm trying to do and what my goal is is to give you guys as much access to me as I possibly can um, and I know sometimes I don't always respond uh, promptly but I do my best to respond to everybody within at least 48 hours so I'm really really working 
looking to that and that is a, my consistent goal so as you text in just give me a little bit of grace and understand that I do get a lot of text but I will be responding to you I promise you that and this is my personal cell phone information so just kind of use that wisely and I'd appreciate that but I do want to encourage you if you haven't signed up yet to go ahead and sign up for the texting membership and remember we stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern I'm on YouTube so I want to invite you to, to that tonight right here on my YouTube channel we will have more videos coming uh, onto our YouTube channel both uh, tonight and tomorrow so I'd encourage you to check those out here's some videos on the screen that you can check out that are going to be very very helpful to you as well but we got a lot of stuff going on and if you want to talk Madden um, with with me or with other people like me and maybe get some different perspectives I'd encourage you to jump in the discord a link to that is in the description as well and last but not least guys if you have not picked up my Madden 21 competitors bundle guide I would highly highly encourage you to do that we have over a hundred pages of breakdowns on the offensive and defensive side of the ball with a full scheme that is really truly going to help you score more points stop more offenses and win more games in Madden NFL 21. Thank you guys so much for your time and I will see you guys on stream tonight at 10 o'clock.